Listen, Shelly Ann Fraser Price lit up the track with her pocket rocket speed and also her colorful hairstyles. So joining me now is one of her wig stylists behind these trendy do's, Shani Hibbert of Shan's Hair Stylist. Hey, Shani, morning. Welcome to Swell Jamaica. Good morning. Thank you for having me. So Simone is going to freak out because Simone's been asking for a wig now for about a year. So we have to go line it up for her, right? Definitely. So tell me, for, for somebody like Shelly Ann, when you, when you put a wig together, do you think about who's going to wear it and, and, and the personality? Of the, of definitely, the definitely. Shelly Ann is a very cheerful person. And as you know, when she's running, she always wants to run in colors and everything. And mm. she loves cheerful colors. She's a very vibrant person and everything. So definitely whenever I'm doing wigs for her, I have to go all in. Yeah. Because, <laughs> listen, she wants she's a done. wig lover. Yes. Yeah. Is, is she one of those customers that is very hands-on? Like she'll come in and say, Shani, no, too much green, Nessa, too much yellow, more that, more that. Oh, all right. The thing is, she sent me pictures and ideas of colors that she'd like and mm -hmm. everything, mm -hmm. and then I executed. So I definitely knew what I was going to do before, so she knew what was she, she was going to get. All right, so talk to me now about the type of hair. Because when Shelly run at that speed, may I say, it's going to drop off, it's going to blow off, it's going to come off. <laughs> was, is it very light? Do you make it very light for her? Okay, I wasn't the person that made the wigs. The wigs okay. were factory made. Okay. I was the person who just colored the wigs. Ah. So, the wig and the body of the wig and everything, mm -hmm. it's a very comfortable density. Mm -hmm. So, it's not that heavy on her head. Uh, natural, natural, natural. Natural weight, right. All right. How did you get into hairstyling? Um, I've been doing hair styling since I was a child, to be honest. Mm -hmm. um, when I was going to Middlebrook High School, I've always been doing my friends hair, whether in the classroom, after school, in the bathroom. So I knew hair styling was, was my thing you. from it was my you. age, definitely. Yeah, but wigs have come such a far way though, Shani. Yes. Um, you know, because people, first time if you have on a wig, you could have probably tell say I have on a wig. Mm -hmm. Now, the installation process takes such, a, it, it's, it's a science to it's me. It's a whole <laughs> process. Yeah. It's a whole process because w the first thing that you have to do, you have to do a ball cap method. That's where you make, um, you use the cap to make it look like your head is bald. So mm -hmm. whenever it's under the lace and you like a makeup part, it looks like natural That's skin. That's naturally your skin. Right. Mm -hmm. So the first step is to make a do a ball cap method. And then after that, you go into the wig installation. Yeah. And I know nowadays some people, and when you got them say, how long you want it on your head? How's the longest if you install it? What's the longest the clients ever worn a wig? Well, my clients, all right, so I use three layers of glue. So you know that's a strong hold. But geez, I'm shining that so, now from up. <laughs> my clients always, my, my clients wigs always stay for a while. Yeah. But how long your wig stays on your head is up to you because with proper care, it definitely will stay a while mm -hmm. and proper installation. So when your wig is installed and you, once you're not out, you like tie it down and with your scarf and you keep it up and everything. Mm -hmm. And uh, as and long as they're not doing any excessive sweating, mm -hmm. then it shall definitely stay. So, so when you see people at pool party, no, some, some, some people as the advertise say, no, the, 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 the wig is pool friendly. Because first time in the people got pool party and then there's them two are touch the water. Right. Do they have the types of glues now if you put it on, you can go everything? Definitely, you have waterproof glue. So okay. when you use that glue, you can go in water and it doesn't come off mm -hmm. because the glue is waterproof. The, wa the glue is waterproof. We're seeing right. some of the styles right now on screen. And what I'm also realizing is People have different tastes. So some people come and say, look, I work in the office mm -hmm. and I want one, but I want it to look as natural That's as possible. So cool. right. um, some want it to be like Shelly when them step in, everybody see them. Yes. Um, so you color as well according to the client? Yes, because some clients are, for instance, a client come and she's working with the government and everything and she doesn't want anything too loud. Mm -hmm. So what we'll do is like some highlights. Okay. So it wouldn't be that loud. So if she want like red highlights, you know, I go through and through and color it red. So when you comb it all through, you just have like patches of red and mm -hmm. brown and everything. So that's more subtle for yeah. her, uh, government work. What do you think are the benefits of, of, of wearing a wig? The benefits of wearing a wig is you don't really get up and do much in the morning, mm -hmm. especially if you have to rush out. Like, for instance, you have on a curly wig mm -hmm. and you have to get up and go somewhere early. When you get up, all you do, you just spray it up with some 
curl activator or you rub some mousse in it and you're gone. And you're gone. Rather than doing your own hair every single morning. Mm. So <laughs> wig, wig wearing, some people don't like wig, but it's something I could recommend. It actually is not time consuming, mm -hmm. like when you're rushing and everything. And rushing, and, it, and, it, mm -hmm. and I think it keeps the curls much longer. It gives you a better right, right. Easy, easy does it. And one of the things I said, but Shelly changed them so regularly too. So you do them in a way that she can just put them on glueless. Well, her Some, wigs were glued yeah. because they you know she running and she everything. Running. So mm -hmm. another stylist where she was glued them but i you know i prep it i color it customize it customizing is like you tweeze the hair for it to get, look have the natural airline look ah. yes so there's a whole process when you do doing wigs you know <laughs> so yeah i tweeze it and everything and then i just send them after her and her stylist will come through and everything all right i gotta hook my girls up here and smile jamaica Definitely. One day. where do we find you well, for now, I'm located in Waterhouse, but I'll be relocating soon. Mm -hmm. so. Well, well, listen, if people want to go where the good things are, right. and that's where she is, if you want Shani, are you on Instagram? Yes, Shan's hairstylist. Shan's hairstylist. Check her out if you want to make sure you have the good look. Check out Shan's, right? Great meeting you, Shani. Thank you, thank you. And Shelly always looks beautiful. Look at that. Yes, <laughs> she pretty. Hey, Mommy Rocket, Shelly and Fraser Price's hairstylist and owner of Shan's hairstylist, Shani Hibbert. Check her out.